Sorry I didn't talk. Sorry we didn't show you everything else. But that's the job. It's the finish. Four hours? By the time I got my butt here. Five hours, all right. Give me five hours. Hey, but don't tell the client. Uh-huh. All right, see you later. Fresh install, bro. Oh, we got one mod to do. There you go. Okay, so one more thing I want to tell you about as well. If you're looking for a contractor who does this kind of work, exactly what we're doing repairs, plus repairs, painting, go onto my website, global.maxkill.com and find someone who's really good, experienced, licensed and all of that in your local area, mainly in Australia and USA and more areas coming soon. And if you do this kind of work, if you're a contractor, definitely jump on the website because they're going to be pushing it a lot more now. And a lot of people come on the channel looking for someone to do the work or to do it themselves. So check it out and I'll see you next time. Bye. That ceiling is all done, start to finish. We did it in two days, and they're even like two half days, pretty much. Have a look around, everything is looking beautiful. The cause of this actual ceiling, I didn't tell you in the beginning, and we didn't figure it out till we pulled it down. Oh, maybe stand this side, maybe the light is better. Grace, stand a bit. That better light? Yeah, yeah, it is actually. Yeah. Uh, what was going on here is there was a ceiling fan in the middle, this right here, and when we pulled it down, there was no framing in which the ceiling fan was connected to. There was uh, some metal furring channel going across. Didn't even look like it was going into that, but even if it was screwed into that, the ceiling was just probably shaking, shaking, and the vibration, so there's that reason. And as well as these 
little bags of insulation that are just tucked up between the furring channel, sitting on the sheet. Now one or two is all right, but the whole ceiling was covered in it, sitting on the board, just pushing it down. So that's what's made it sag. There wasn't any water damage in here. Um, and uh, I promised them that we'll get it done in two days. And here we are, two days is done, lunch time. We're gonna get out of here. So that was the reason why this ceiling failed. No blocking inside. And actually the corners just came down so easy as well. They didn't use good corner cement. So when I talk up my corner cement, I mean using the good product of corner cement. Um, not the 90 minute stuff. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. This is our ceiling. How much would you charge to replace this ceiling? It's 3.1 by 2.9, something like that. Remove and replace and paint, or if you don't paint, just how much to remove and replace and come back and sand and uh, reinstate that AC duct. Let me know. Anyway, that's the product. Zoom in the corners here. We're not afraid to. We're not afraid to zoom in on this channel. Beautiful. Not afraid to zoom in, guys. Anyway, that's it. Thanks very much. I'll see you next time. Bye.